I'm Whiskey Coco. I'm from Nashville, Tennessee, born in California, raised in the South. I mostly sand. 90% <laughs> of painting, I would say, is sanding, but it's, it's art, it's technical, it's measuring, it's specific, it's caring about something. It's putting your, your thoughts and your emotion almost to a degree into a job in order to make sure that it comes out the way you want it in very particular. And I think that letting the artists do what they want to do is half of it. It's like going and getting tattooed. I said, this is the idea I have, but I don't want this exact thing. I want your version of it because they're putting their heart and soul into that more than just copying something. And I feel like that's the same with painting. Like when you get more room to be creative, you get more of yourself in there and your style in it flows more freely into a better job. I was leaving my neighborhood on my motorcycle September 25th, 2019, and I got T-boned by a lady who decided she didn't want to stop for a red light. So I was down for about six months, could not put any pressure on my leg, couldn't stand on it, nothing, and had talked to a couple people on Instagram and one of them guy was like, oh, you could totally paint your bike. And I was like, oh, I don't think so. I think only professionals can do that. He was like, no, no, I learned. And so I kind of checked it out on YouTube to see if I could even wrap my brain around it. And I was like, okay, I think I could, but I gotta learn from someone. I'm a hands-on learner. I started going to this painter in Vistas and learning from him. Then I hit Pete up and I'd actually met him the weekend before my accident. So I hit him up and I said, oh, my leg's broken, but I'd still like to come learn if I can. And I've been coming ever since and learning and utilizing everything he teaches me, soaking it up like a sponge and enjoying it, trying to enjoy it and still grow and still learn. But yeah, that's how I got into it, kind of by accident. I, I get my social life from, I think, barbering and then my creative from painting. And that's what I love about the painting is everything's its own creation. and. You know, there's so much to learn. Oh my gosh, it's like endless things to learn, endless possibilities, and I'm just getting started.